World War Z is a cooperative third-person shooter where you and four of your friends can take on massive swarms of zombies. The action promises to be fast-paced and follow characters and new storylines based on the Paramount picture of the same name and the book. Our review is based on the PS4 version of the game. The game itself feels very similar and akin to Left 4 Dead, a game that many hope for a return. But fear not, Saber Interactive has done a great job of bringing the movie, books, world to life. With waves of more than 500 zombies hunting you down with Saber's own swarm engine rendering the details in frightening ways, you have a few ways to play it at your disposal. You can either go in all guns blazing or take a more methodical approach. The game does an amazing job at adapting to your playstyles. When playing with friends it's easier to coordinate your playstyles, however, in open multiplayer things can get a little out of control and there is always one person who rushes in half cocked. With a total of 4 missions available and multiple ways in which to play, there is plenty to get into. The missions themselves cover several continents and cities ranging from Jerusalem to Tokyo. Each area brings its own amazing looking visuals. Again. There are several ways in which you can approach the levels, with branching paths and each time you play the zombie hordes behave differently. If the game thinks you are finding it too easy, it raises the stakes and throws a new twist to keep you on your toes. The zombies on higher difficulties become very sensitive to noise which makes your playstyle matter. Each individual mission is its own story, much like Left 4 Dead, and are set at different times of the war and there are no tie-ins with the movie itself, which was both a shame and a welcome sight. Giving the developers a chance to tell new stories and expand on the universe using the book for inspiration and there are endless possibilities for other episodes to be available in future DLC. There are a total of six unique classes available at launch, the Gunslinger, Hellraiser, Slasher, Medic, Fixer and Exterminator each with customizable weapons and abilities ranging from rocket launchers to gas grenades and even a crossbow so you can live out your Daryl fantasies. And there are a total of 16 characters. Depending on the episode you play depends on the character you can play. Each character has their own backstory and audio clips you can play within the menu fleshing out each individual. One thing irritated us, during a couple of playthroughs we opted to play with AI characters and although they are solid they fail to use heavy weapons or go quietly instead opening fire as soon as you get close to a target. At times it also felt as though the zombies had more sense than the AI characters. All in all World War Z is a worthy successor to Left 4 Dead with plenty of replayability, interesting characters, fluid and dynamic gameplay. For a half price game it is well worth the price tag and honestly would be satisfied paying the same as a AAA game. Let us know in the comments below if you are going to pick up World War Z and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe 